Hi everyone, today I'm so excited to share with you the party prep and decor for my son's trash truck themed birthday. Um, this was something he chose after we looked at pictures on Pinterest and he saw a picture of this trash truck cake and that was it. So that's where we got our party theme and I'm going to start off by showing you the easy making of the cake. I am no professional baker by any means. I am using store-bought cake and icing and I am just making this fun and it was definitely the hit of the party. The kids were so excited to see the trash truck on the cake and all of the treats pouring out the back like trash. So as you can see, I just baked two round cakes and stacked them together. I didn't even flatten them um, and I'm covering them with plain vanilla icing and then I'm going to put this little trash chuck that I found on Amazon right on top. I will have everything I use linked below. Here I am just taping this because I want all the treats to pour out as if trash is pouring out of the trash chuck. And then I am using a mixture of Oreo cookies, gummies, M&Ms. Um, gummy watermelon, Swedish fish, and sprinkles to make the trash. As you can see, this was very easy. Um, it's kind of a messy cake, which is actually the fun and it makes it really easy to do. I just scattered the treats as I saw fit and then I filled in everything with the sprinkles and it worked out really well. And here is the final look at what the cake looked like once I had all the treats on. So the cake was kind of the centerpiece of the decorations, but I feel like when you're dealing with little kids and toddlers, cupcakes are actually better. So I am making a very simple cupcake, and I apologize, this is like terrible footage of what I did with the cupcakes, but um, I just put um, rainbow chip icing on them, and then I put these little trash truck toppers that I got on Etsy, and then I sprinkled the sprinkles out of the back of the trash truck similar to the cake, so it looked like it was trash coming from the trash truck.
that I have shown you all of the cakes and desserts, I am going to show you the process of the decor that I did. I am doing some balloons. They're kind of like I did small balloon arches or balloon garlands, but I just hung them in straight lines because um, it was just easier for the space and the fact that I also had a banner. So right now I am blowing up the balloons. If you ever want to do a balloon garland or balloons for a birthday party, you have to get this pump from Amazon or sometimes they have it at Target. That's $20 you will spend on party prep. Here what I'm trying to show you is I got this balloon garland tape that's balloon tape. It is so much easier to make a balloon garland this way. I used to make them with my own string. You just pull the balloons through the holes that they give you and it puts them together in one big strip and then you can also use that to hang it on the wall. So this tape makes it so much easier than trying to do it yourself. One of the other great things about using this balloon tape is that the, you can then use it to hang it on the wall. Um, just leave a little tail on one or both sides of the balloon garland that you're making and then you can use it to hang. I'm using a push pin here. Um, it, it does take a little maneuvering to get it hung, but um, the tape makes it much easier. What I'm showing you here is that this balloon garland and banner set also came with these little stickies that you can use to attach extra balloons. So once your garland's done, if you need to fill in some areas or you just want to add some little balloons, they provided these little sticky things that you can just stick the balloons in on top of the garland, which I loved and they were so easy.
So for the entertainment for the party, we kept it super simple. Three-year-olds, we set up two water tables and a truck washing station, and they were a huge hit. They played in the water tables pretty much the entire time. So for the truck washing station, I just had these squirt bottles, and I put soap and water in them, and then I put water in these plastic spray bottles, cut some sponges in half, and then had a separate tub with plastic monster trucks for them to wash. Um, they were very into this in the beginning and then they ended up dumping the soap in the water table and they played with the water tables for a majority of the time. So that is pretty much everything for our three-year-old trash truck birthday party prep, decor, and activities. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you gained maybe a little bit of fun inspiration for this for your toddler's next birthday and I will see you in the next one.